Welcome to Cricket Victoria's Coaching Clips. I'm Cricket Victoria Academy coach, Sean Flegler. Today we're joined by Bush Ranger spinner, James Muirhead. Welcome, Jim. Thanks, Flex. In this clip, we're focusing on wrist spin bowling. Wrist spin is commonly referred to as leg spin or left arm Chinaman. The grip. Rest the ball between the third finger and thumb. Ensure the grip is not too loose, but not too tight. The fourth and fifth fingers can be folded into the palm. Approach. Balance and rhythmical. The approach should build momentum towards the target. Gather. Ensure that the jump in the gather is directed towards the stumps at the batter's end. During the gather, the bowler is encouraged to cock their wrist ready for release. Feet alignment. Generally for a wrist spinner, the back foot should land parallel to the return crease and front foot should land at 45 degrees. Action. The bowler should have a strong front arm, pulling the elbow down to the hip to trigger the action. One key to the action is a braced front leg which allows the bowler to drive up and over with the back leg coming through towards the target. Release. For the stock delivery, the bowling arm should not be too high, but not too low either. The release of the wrist spinner's stock ball should see the back of the bowling hand facing the central umpire. The follow through should take the bowling arm past the opposite ribs, which ensures the action has been completed. Once completing the action, it is important for the bowler to be ready for the return catch. Variations, the top spinner and the wrong end. For the top spinner, the release point is slightly higher and the back of the hand should face the bowler's head. For the wrong end, the release point is slightly lower and the back of the hand should be facing the batter on strike. Thanks for watching Cricket Victoria's Coaching Clips. 